Welcome to Patch Lab. In today's episode, I'm going to explain this patch, so let's listen to it in the first place. In the previous patch I used the 4MS quad clock distributor as a rhythm generator and I was using it to trigger drums from Tip Top Audio over here. I used the 808 hi-hats in a rather unique way because I didn't took the outputs of either hi-hat but I took the bandpass output and I voltage controlled the Q factor which enhances the spectral qualities of the hi-hat sound which I uh, VCA'd with the Linux over here. The clock division and multiplication factors can be voltage controlled with the QCD with those inputs over here. I voltage control them with those outputs of the pressure point where I presetted some pre-programmed values which give me the desired multiplication and division factors. This module is sequenced by its expander, brains, which I just clock occasionally with the branches model which is underneath below out of shot. The sound for the melodic part is generated by Telharmonic from Soundtech and Make Noise. It has three algorithms parallelly running, noise, harmonic and phase mod. I use the phase mod for this patch and I modulate the centroid and the flux parameters with the slow rate LFO. To generate a melody, I use IntelliJ Metropolis over here. I use the pre-programmed scale to quantize the notes and I'm also using the auxiliary B input to pre-transpose the notes that are generated. That means the transposition value is also quantized in respect to the scale that I'm using. Finally, the whole audio in the patch is being routed through 4MS Spectral Multiband Resonator over here which resonates a series of frequencies given by either a pre-programmed scale or the user can define scales as well. I was using octaves in this case. I almost forgot to mention the reverb I was using in this patch. That was the make noise or verb from Soundtag. It was set to a whole kind of reverb which is rather long and lush. This was a quick video about demonstrating the massive musical potential of those new modules. Now it's your turn, keep on patching.